and shoved out of bounds at the 43. Zips it to the tight end. He's at the 30. And they make the stop at the 25-yard line. Touchdown, Iowa State. Away. Landrum from the nine. He's out to the 30. Across midfield. He's got the corner. Inside the 30. Touchdown, Texas Tech. That was some play by the special teams. The smart quarterbacks and offensive line. And he's taken down around the 46-yard line. Well, the defensive backs completely jumped. Dangerous throw, and this one's picked off to the 20. And he scores. Touchdown. Personal foul. Flipping. Offense. Into coverage, just picked off. <laughs> guys want to show that they can hang on to it. He's to the 40. Makes it out to about the 50. That's good for and he's hit before he can go anywhere. The Red Raiders are going to call. Touchdown, Red Raiders. Outstanding run and great execution by the entire offensive unit, especially the blocking up front. Quarterback and the windows that he's trying to find, much easier to find for a quarterback and the receivers to pick up big yards like we just saw there. Knocked out of bounds. The seven yard. Gets it out quickly. And he's taken down at the 33. Brooks takes him down behind the line. Good number. Why well, he has, but let's also give some credit to the offensive line. He's doing a tremendous job of pushing the defensive line back to give the running back some room to work with. And he's just given this defense fits because of his ability to make big plays, and already we've seen him get into the end zone a couple times. Throws a strike over the middle. The 10. He's all the way home. Touchdown. Got to take a really good ball fake here to get this safety to bite up. But he did a really good job, and with the safety out of position, they're able to get the football into the end zone. Inside the 10. They get on the board again. Touchdown. Slings it to the 20. He's pushed out of bounds at the end. Welcome back to the channel, brethren of the gridiron. The time is here. It's bowl week. I'm ready to get it. Um, it's the last episode into the season. Um, as you saw the little highlights and little tidbits right before this. Um, yeah, we ended up getting the Buffalo Wild Wing Bowl in Tempe, Arizona. So I'm definitely excited to jump into it. Um, recruiting stopped. Uh, it's our last game with our seniors, so I think I already know what uniform I want to rock. Our best looking ones. 
We're just gonna go with it. Um, yeah, let's just jump into it. Let's finish this season strong. All right, so the matchup today, uh, 84 over 86 overall, both 90, and the only difference is plus three on their defense. So it's like super even matchup, it should be. So, I want to go out in the never quits. It's been messing up a lot. I've been trying to get these shoes back on us uh, with the black socks. But it keeps putting the opposite, so hopefully this will work. Um, We'll have our shoes to match the rest of our uniform, but yeah, for our seniors, I want them to rock out in the never quits. Our best looking uniform, in my opinion. So let's get it going. We're both seven and five. Buffalo Wild Wings Bowl week. They got home field advantage, but we got home uniforms. Let's go. So let's look at their top players of the game. Uh, McMillan, quarterback, number nine, 88 overall. Um, their punter, 86. And their tight end, 85. So it looks like they're offense heavy. It's bowl week. I'm ready to get it. Hi, everybody. Reese Davis yeah. Reese bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 pregame show. Look at us rocking our sexy uniforms Nissan. out there. Innovation that excites. We take you now to Buffalo the Wild Wings Bowl Week. As these two teams try to change out here in the Sun Devil Stadium. By finishing with a victory in the Buffalo Wild Wings Bowl. That's going to do it for us. Thanks for checking out the pregame show. NCAA college football action coming right at you. Brad and Let's Kirk get that Bowl call. Week Buffalo David Wild Wings hype video, out. though. said neutral site but it's all red out there pretty much <laughs> oh it actually gave us our black and red shoes it hasn't let us win those in a while kept putting those black and whites he sends this one deep let's run it out he's to the 10 what a collision For the first play of the game, we're going to give our boy one last time. Alexander gets it on the inside. Oh, oh, oh he got laid out. Alexander's looking to get in the record books in this one. He's a very special player, and he really deserves all the praise and awards he could get. Big game for this guy. He's out to the oh, broken He's out on him the again. Line. There's nothing more effective that a team he almost went all the way on that one. Than to pound the ball right at the defense, trying to wear him down. Time to throw him off guard a little bit. They'll spread the field with five wide. Let's it oh, he's wide open. Big catch there. <laughs> oh, there you go. I saw him dirty. Oh, 
very hey good God, in space. Brad, it's a, it's a first down. And, and a, obviously, this offense right now is trying to maintain. Touchdown. Oh, and he fell in there. Oh, he got the school record. Alexander going out and putting himself in the books. Or he might have tied it in what are, what are they doing. And he tackles him hard at the 22. Lots of three yards on the play. Catches it and he's looking for more. And oh. down he goes at the 30. Nothing doing for the offense and it's for We got that stop though. Nicely done. Out in the open. Out of bounds. Oh. A quarterback's best friend is a receiver he can count on to catch. We're through one quarter. They just took that one Red more Bears second to get off. The sack shouldn't have happened. They'll bring him down at the 35 yard line. Ooh. The 27 yard line. And for Sampson, he at Passes left. Gets oh, I missed. Half. How did I miss Eight him? Come on. And he shoved out of bounds. This man 49. picked up 20 yards on some BS. Oh, come on. These guys are gonna go straight option on me, I guess. How's he allowed to get back up? That's cheating. Gets out to around the 12. Come on. Touchdown, Come on. Cats. This kid is a really reliable weapon. You definitely want the football in his hands near the end zone. He Tries to pitch it and now the oh, that was sketchy. Pitch that was sketchy. Decides to slide. They're eating up a lot of field on this drive. Up. Quick oh, come it. on. How are you going to drop that? Come on. To go it's a great job here by the quarterback of recognizing the outside linebacker blitz. And here's a quick throw. Get that, get that pick. And he can't oh. make the pitch. The pass falls incomplete. Downs was the intended receiver. Fires oh, got the pick. And oh, no, come on. He couldn't beat him. He telegraphed that throw. He eyed his receiver the whole way. That was an easy read by the defense. And Washington on streak, too. Fakes to the back. He chucks it downfield. The defender had his hands on it, but Nothing. it's incomplete. Oh, this is going to be a rough game. We played a half. We get a tie game at 7-7. Our teams are definitely equally matched. We've played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. Defense has been in total control in the first half, and you'd think maybe the offense's confidence was shaken. But if you want to look at the entire team picture, David, how big a deal is it for an offense to know, look, if we can just put together one, maybe two good scoring drives, our defense has got our back. Well, a lot of times when you know you have a defense, it's great, too, is you build your offense around it. And when I say that, why do I need to take chances? You know, if it's third and long, I don't mind throwing a five-yard pass, and if I break a tackle, I get a first down. I mean, 
don't put my defense that's dominant, that's great, in a bad position, and, and you can afford to be more conservative. You see it every single year. What do we always talk about here at ESPN? We talk about you, you defense wins championships, and that's how you win ball games, and you see it consistently unfold. So if I'm building an offense, let's just not put my great dominant defense in a bad position. That's it for us here in the studio. What are you going to do in the second half of the game's going on? Yeah, I'm going to kick back and watch all these monitors. We'll keep you up to date on everything going on around the country right now. Time for the second half with Brad and Kirk. Ah, come on. He's to the 40. Oh, wow. At the 30. To this the dude's just going to break out like that? 10. Touchdown, Northwestern. Wow. He's been tearing it up in the running game. That carry puts him over 100 yards. They've been playing for this all season, and he knows he's got to be at his very best on every play. Come on. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. He's to the 20. And he's tackled at the 24-yard line. Northwestern's continuing to play extremely tough defense. This has been impressive. It's just been impressive to watch them play with such an attitude, almost a chip on their shoulder with the energy that they're playing with. Oh, he's Alexander making moves. Come on. Line. Great job by the running back, and that's a gain of nine. That brings up second and one. Oh, ain't, ain't nobody right gonna side. block him. For a gain of six yards. That'll bring up second and three. Oh, oh barely made down. that. He's out of bounds. It went right over that man's shoulder. I thought that was a pick. Probably gonna have to start going to the air. He's gonna go for the home run. Oh, dirty! <laughs> Ingram! <laughs> that was freaking beautiful. I just saw him for a split second. knows what he has to do to contribute to make his team successful. Oh, he's about to take a hit too. <laughs> That's a way to get back in the game. Look at that one more time. Yeah, right there, I saw him just barely get behind those guys. That's how you win a game. Hard line. Man, both offenses here in this third quarter have been on fire. Time for the defense to step to the forefront a little bit. Makes you wonder which of these defenses has the ability to come up and make a stop. It could be one of those games where whichever defense comes up with that stop could be the team that wins the game. Come on, guys. Makes a stop right around the 42 yard line. And down he goes at the 45. That's a loss of three yards. Team. Got a man, watch out here. And he tackles him hard at the 25. Shot on the tackle at the 25 yard line. So at the end of the third quarter, we're deadlocked right now. It's coming down to the wire. In we got to make something happen four, here. Tie ball game. Wow, a 
Washington, come on. And the way this game has been played and how tight it's been, every defense got you. Just give up on that play and get ready for the next down. The quarterback in the gun, empty backfield. Five wide receivers in the formation. Completes it, and he's hit hard immediately. It would be like a monster, but our line just freaking sucks. Quick throw. He's tackled around the 32 yard line. That's a game of 13 in the play. First down. This is ridiculous. Now he tries to buy some time. I just had to throw it. I am freaking. No one was open. Come on. Nice Come on. Something, please. Hands it to the back. Makes it out to about the forty-six. I'm just gonna get beat. I don't even see a good play. I'm just about to call timeout because and they get nice yardage on that run. And we're calling Defense timeout. Puts an end to the no-huddle offense by calling timeout. I'm literally blitzing on these guys. I see it coming, but I can't do nothing. to throw outside. Oh, he had a shot at the pick. Great We're probably going to kick the field goal. In that pass. That's not an easy play to make. Trying to get it to the oh, I was there. It's on fourth down, and the ball will change hands. Hey, it's the last game of the season. Might as well pull out all the stops. That's a great play by the defense. You need your playmakers to really come. I just need here. to get down there. Just over two minutes in the game. Down. 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 Nice run up the middle. Alex Gotta Taylor. get something. Come on. on the play. That makes it second and six. Here he goes. Decides to slide. They go with the option and pick up the first down. Yeah, and that was a situation where the quarterback knew he could pick up the first down if he kept it himself. That's a oh, Alexander. Run up the middle. He's had no problem finding running room today. That makes it 100 second and eight. Ball on the 42 yard line. No, he was open. What was that? The, team, the defensive coordinator came up with here. They were... Under a minute left in the game. No playmakers on this team. Oh, that's why. Wide. wide open. Catch that. Oh, my God. Freaking. Let's go. Sometimes you just can't stop a good combination. Come on. 30 seconds. Him hard at the 29 yard line. Gain of two yards. That makes it second and eight. In front of you. So you're kind of feeling things out behind you. Come on, Alexander. We need you right kind of here. Surveying that land to be able to make the play. Here, I think he got a little tip from the quarterback's eyes to be able to make that play on the football. Just a tremendous play there late in the fourth quarter in a tie. They're going to ice game. the kicker. Folks, we're either going to see victory with this field goal or overtime. Here we go. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. That's a bowl win right there. It's like he doesn't even feel the pressure. They didn't ice him.
a squib it. That's the game. The <laughs> that was a freaking crazy game. Oh my god. So this one's in the books, and we saw a great one here today. 17, that 14, was a crazy game. That was frustrating. Take a look at the highlights, Kirk. How would you summarize the action <laughs> in this one? Well, this one really could have gone either way. It literally came down to a kick for a kicker that we're replacing. To win this football game, but it wasn't meant to be today. All you can do now is try to bounce back after a close loss like this. Ah, oh, that was insane. Those are the games you live for, though. Here's a look at today's player of the game. Alexander's last game. It's our last time seeing this man. For and he Red broke Raiders, a record, too. They another one late in the season, giving them an 8-5 record. And for the Wildcats, they go to 7-6 and six on what has been an average season. There it is, the Buffalo Wild Wings trophy. We finally got at least one kind of hardware this season. <laughs> yeah, and there she is, the crazy trophy. <laughs> but yeah, that, that was a crazy game. Um, just coming through, last kick of the game. Um, especially with a guy that we're getting ready to get rid of. <laughs> That team was just really good. We just couldn't figure out how to beat them. Um, and they just shut down our run game. Um, yeah, it was cool, you know, seeing Alexander get himself into the record books. Um, sucks we couldn't get him any hardware. He definitely deserved it. Our, our, just, our team wasn't built for it. So at least we got him one trophy, we got him the Buffalo Wild Wings. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you guys definitely enjoyed this season. Um, I had a lot of fun. I can't wait to see this team get built. Uh, we should have a better line coming through, better kicker and a quarterback. And I believe we have a good running back to George Mason. So this team is definitely on the right tracks. Um, hopefully we can improve our record next year, even if it's just by one win, and just slowly keep getting better until we win the Big 12. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode and this season, and I will catch you all in the next season, Cowboys. <laughs>